Do you edit any of the presentations you place on YouTube? No, we don't edit the presentations we place on YouTube. We might trim off a bit of uh, superfluous comments at the front of the presentation and at the end of the presentation where you know I'm talking about mundane things relating to the audience that's particularly there and not to a worldwide audience. But the actual presentation itself is unedited all the way through. When I say unedited, the, the, the guys who are doing the video obviously need to, need to shoot to, can, to turn one video in, turn everything into one video from two cameras or even three cameras so that requires a process of switching but we don't actually edit what happened we don't cut bits out that we don't like what happened where we don't like what happened or cut bits out where we said the wrong thing or cut bits out they, that all stays in and the beauty of it staying in is that it, 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 it lets everybody see exactly what happened on the day now, if we need to correct something, then we'll come back later and we'll correct it by saying some more things. And I feel that is the way God also wishes us to be. God, God, anything that's happened in the past has happened. That's reality. We can't rewrite history. All we can do is correct it. If, if it was an error, we can correct it, but we can't rewrite it. So my feelings are I want an accurate record of history. And if I need to correct it, because I've learned something new or I've become more developed in love or I've learned a new truth, then I will correct it. Uh, when I know that truth or when I've become more developed in love and to know that truth, I will correct it then, but not before then. Um, until that time, it will remain indelibly etched as it, as it is and it will always remain as a record. The beauty of that is that you have an accurate record of history. Unfortunately, with the way mankind creates history on the earth, it's very interesting because, because most of the time, history is not even written accurately. It is written by the people who want to give a certain slant to the history. And then later on, it's written even more and some things are completely written out of history, in fact, uh, and new generations of people don't even know that they even occurred. In the spirit world, it's very different because every record of history is a complete and accurate record of history and often there is books with a, with a comparison in the spirit world where they have a list of the thing that people on earth said happened and then what actually happened next to it. And it's a very interesting contrast. On earth, everyone wants to maintain a facade, wants to usually present themselves to be better than they actually are, wants to present the actual event to be better than it was. And as a result of that, there's a heavy desire to edit. I don't have those desires. I want things to be exactly as they are. And if I need to correct something in the future, something that I've done wrong in the past, then I'll correct it. Um, aside from that, no, I'm not going to correct it until I recognise that it's actually wrong. Mm. Mm.